This is my current dust extraction system. It consists of a small Titan vacuum cleaner attached to a cyclone on top of a large drum to collect all the sawdust. It's pretty efficient, the Titan vac is good, but all I have is just the one rather long five meter hose that I can use for various different attachments and I can attach it to my machines, I attach it to my miter saw, my belt and disc sander, my spindle sander, my table saw and my band saw. So quite a few different machines that I attach it to. Given this is such a small workshop, it makes it a bit difficult just having the one hose. So I'm gonna build a dust extraction system and part one is gonna involve the making of some blast gates that I'm gonna use for each machine. The foundation for my dust extraction system is gonna be this 40 mil waste pipe. It's quite cheap over here in the UK and I'm using what's called push fit so I can just push it onto the different connectors and I don't need any solvent or compression fixings to fix it together. For the blast gates themselves I'm going to use this 8mm high density polyethylene that I had for another project. You can get it on eBay nice and rigid and it also cuts and drills and you can route it really easily. It's really nice to work with. Got quite a glossy finish so I'm hoping it will slide quite well for the actual blast gates themselves.
I made this simple bracket that I'm going to mount on the wall. I just put some screws through the back um, into the wall and then the blast gate will sit on the top. So for demonstration purposes I've um, screwed the bracket to the bench and you can see how the gate works. You can also tell that it's producing a good vacuum when you close it. I'll demonstrate. You'll hear the sound of the back change. I've put a load of dust on the worktop and I'll show the suction changing now. So that's the last gate construction completed. I'm really pleased with how it's come out. It's quite compact, it doesn't need to be big because of the diameter of hose. Um, and it didn't take long to make and because it was using material I had already, it was, uh, it was quite cheap as well. So I've just got six more to make now, shouldn't take too long. In my next video I'm going to use all the blast gates I built and actually put together my dust extraction system. So keep your eyes peeled for that. I'll put a link up to it once the video is created, should be in about a week or two. There'll be a link to subscribe coming up here. And if you're interested in any of my other videos, I'll put some links up at the end. I'm also raising money for a charity this year and there'll be just some information about that about to pop up. If you're interested, please have a look. Hopefully see you again soon.